All right, everyone. We're going to have an amazing hurricane coming to town. And it's Hurricane Irma. And let me tell you about the storm. All Pasco schools close tomorrow and Tuesday. Mom's workplace on New York Avenue is also closed. We're helping HSN hosts that don't go to Nashville survive the storm. And we're also helping HSN models survive the storm as well. If a power outage occurs, we'll have cold foods, tea, water, and other drinks before, during, and after the storm. Candles are ideal for nighttime power outages. Desktop computers won't work during power outages, but laptop computers, cell phones, and portable TVs and DVD players will still work. Alright? And we are almost ready for the storm. And before we get ready, I'm going to go to a friend such as my mom. Yeah, I need to know about that right now. From mom. Come on. You ain't going crazy over what's happening. Might need to put a whole DVD collection in the van too. Sorry kids. It ain't gonna be alright. I guess there are kids in this house. So, there actually ain't kids in the house as much as there are in my sister's house. Mom's preparing for the storm. Dangerous stuff. Oh well. I think the wind and rain may start to get bigger. How about my Energizer batteries, Mom? I've got batteries. The Energizer batteries. I know who's going to be prepared for Irma. It's uh, me, you, my sister, Mackenzie, Keith Jr., Caden, and my ladies including Kayla, Stacy, Claudia, Sonia, Miss O'Brien, Allison, and finally Tina. Come on, in the van. I'm not going uh, to... Alright. I told Mom. Come on, guys. It'll be alright. Oh, yes. It's going to be fine throughout our storm. And I can't believe we're going to survive, folks. All right, ladies and gentlemen, the power's out. That's right, and it's because of Hurricane Irma. You're exactly right, Miss O'Brien. What did Miss O'Brien say? She knows a lot about a hurricane like Irma. Does she know? I don't think she does. And I guess it'll be the first hurricane that she'll ever survive in Pasco County, folks. Stay away from my drink, Rocky. And in a hurricane, what? lots of people need stuff in the event of power outages. Candles, flashlights, TVs, portable DVD players, well, laptop computers, like and anything. lots of other things that will help in the event of a power outage during a major hurricane or other type of hurricane, I think. But it's okay, it'll be alright. We're going to enjoy the hurricane as much as other people will. Is that true, Justin? It sure is, Kara. And as far as I'm concerned, joining us for the power outage are my ladies, and they include Kayla, Stacy, Claudia, Sonia, 
and so Brian, Allison, and finally Tina. It'll be alright though, because it's going to be a big storm after all. That's right. <laughs> Are you ready? I am. Yeah, I am. We know we're ready for the storm. <laughs> well, here's a good view from some place. Anyway, that's good. It's all right, Dennis. <laughs> Making fun of ABC Absolute. That's WFTS Channel 28, the ABC affiliate in our area, the Tampa Bay area of Florida. It'll be all right because it's a great storm. I guess weatherman Dennis is right. Anyway, we're all going to survive Irma. I don't care about that. Anyway, she's a powerful storm. I agree that she is a serious storm for some peeps living in the Tampa Bay area. They usually send their planes in it right it's, on uh, in the ocean still before it gets so bad. Oh man. I was watching uh, the guys when it was a five. That is right. <laughs> and I guess a friend's so favorite weather now. Dennis. So You're the best. Oh wow. Well. So, uh, Alright. I like to thank that guy, and that's, um, of course, Dennis has worked at Channel 28 for a lot of years, and maybe he's trying to help us with Irma. Yeah. I'd like to get a shout out to everyone. Oh, well. Oh, well. A big shout out to everybody working at HSN in Florida. Some people working there decided to move to Nashville as a result of Irma. All right. Power got knocked out by Irma. Anyway, it's all right. And here are the real people surviving the hurricane. They are um, me, my mother, and my sister, Lacey, niece, Mackenzie, and nephews, Keith and Caden. But it'll be alright. I would like to also call my first nephew, Keith Jr., since he's the son of a late friend that I had. Oh, wow. Well. In this case, my brother Keith. And he's in heaven now. <laughs> I guess it'll be alright with that. Well, that's good thinking. <laughs> That's what Dennis at Channel 28 decided. <laughs> I'm making fun of Tampa Bay Area TV and radio stations. <laughs> and it'll be the funniest hurricane in the world. Oh well. Yes. And we're shooting a good feeling in a power outage. We're shooting for what Irma wants to do. <laughs> oh, yes. Hopefully. It's alright because of Irma. 
and everybody is ready. I agree that Sonia is okay and hopes to survive a hurricane that works out. Dennis is one of the people who decided on that extreme wind warning that had been issued for a well-trained period of time. I'm going to make fun of Tampa Bay area TV stations that do the newscast. But I'm going to do it at least for the earliest part of the power outage. All right. Oh, wow. Okay. <coughs> oh. Maybe it'll be all right. All I had were the emergency drinks. There are people having emergency food and drinks and power outages. It'll be all right, though. So, now is our chance to survive Irma. And she is going to do well. We can't believe she just hit the state of Florida, at least Miami. Oh well. Oh well. I guess, um, I would like to introduce you to two of the best sugar gliders in the world. And they are Rascal and Roxy. A third sugar glider is with us all for the hurricane and her name is Sweetie Pie, I believe. And I agree more. But it'll be alright even until the power gets back up and running, folks. I agree more. You're right, Car. Hey, Justin. Yes. We're already prepared for Irma. Hold on. I agree more. I agree more. I can't believe the power has just gone out here in our apartment complex, folks. It will be okay. The electric company is going to put the power back up real soon. It'll be all right. That is right there. I would do something even further because it'll be all right because Irma is going to be a good storm that anyone will remember. Yep. And she is. Hey. This would be okay. Some places may have ba backup generators. Others won't. Nope. Not at all. We won't have backup generator, folks. I agree more. But it'll be alright because it's good. Alright. Alright. We're going to conclude the hurricane power outage with a fun light thing that will work. It'll be fun, won't it? I know it will. So, everyone's prepared. I had a great time. My mother, Lana, had a great time. And my sister Lacey, my niece Mackenzie, my nephews Keith Jr. and Caden. Maria, Kristen, Kayla, Stacy, Claudia, Sonia, Mr. O'Brien, Allison, Tina, and Trisha, who's been around the apartment complex for over eight years now, as far as I'm concerned. Would you like to provide comments before the power goes back up? We sure will. Have to 
to that coming. I'm guessing it'll be fine. A good night would be fine. Pressure's on. Pressure's on. Oh, <laughs> I agree with you. You agree with me, Miss O'Brien? Yeah. What's going on? I have a lot to do. Well, go ahead. We're going to do it together, okay? Okay. How about you, Allison? Well, I am a dream catcher after all. A friend wants to catch her dream. That's Allison. Oh, yeah. A friend may need flood insurance one day. But it'll be alright. Steve and Bob are the best survivors in the history of a power outage in the world. Ice cream boy. I hope that we're going to be the best survivors in the history of power outages worldwide. That's right. We know that it would be a very interesting thing. Oh, yeah. That is good thinking. Sometimes the most popular friend will worry about that. Even though we're the best residents in the history of the apartment complex. We know about that. And I know about that. So I thought about a friend going nuts with other friends. People starting to have their clothes looked at. Yep. Oh well. I'd have to go to a fashion store one day. Thinking about that. We won't have to worry about it. At least we'll be good for now. Yeah, we will. We'll all come together to have the power back up and running. I agree with you. If somebody can turn up a juice pod. Tina, how's that? A toughie. A tough decision. You know what's tough, Tina? Nothing. Nothing's tough? I'll show you what's tough. Something that's tough enough. <laughs> Maybe I'd be very happy with friends and relatives. HSN models, they had the chance to survive Hurricane Irma. And they're very lucky. Oh well. But here's the breakdown of Irma. It was a Category 3 hurricane when we evacuated. It became a Category 2 hurricane before the power just went out. And it later became a Category 1 hurricane before eventually becoming a tropical storm. Is that correct? Yep. I know the weather information, folks. The good news is that a friend will have fun and excitement Whatever we can have. Right? Right. Alright, folks. We're getting a good move coming. Oh, yeah. Then maybe tomorrow or some other day. We'll be fine. The carrot juice is for other people who like drinking carrot juices. We don't like those. We like tea. Do we? Yeah, we do. The tea is very easy to drink. 
and I'm showing you right now that the key is just wonderful. Wonderful. We'll go around town thinking it's an eventual blackout. A friend of mine will let you do it. In the middle of the night, there was a wacky blackout last night at my sister's house, which led into Miss O'Brien being a good woman that will help with power outages of any kind. Are you for real? Everything will be right if nothing goes wrong. Oh, yes. What's next wrong? The power has been out for less than 24 hours now. A friend just got off the phone with the power company. And they are headed for the intersection of Little Road and Denton Avenue. We would be next. We would be next. We would be next. Alrighty. Oh, yeah. 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 It's getting closer to our apartment. I can't believe the hurricane hit this apartment. You're right about that. I know how the hurricane would safely hit this apartment, in particular. And survival is a primary concern. All right. All right, we're on for the final moment of the power outage. That was caused by Irma. You're right. We're going to have to feel good when the power goes back up. That's right. We're going to do it when the power gets back up and running, folks. But I know it's going to be all right. We're going to have a great time and continue into the night that power is going to be back up. Here. We'll get a really close shot right from here and it will fill the darkness I'm right over here and I decided that I was looking good looking great the magic will not disappear if someone turns up the juice we'll be alright I know turning up the juice as getting the power back up and running because I like that familiar phrase you're right oh well I hope it's got to be kidding for any other people the electricians are trying to turn up the juice right now oh yeah they're going to attempt to turn up the juice. Oh. Yeah. Crank up the juice. You gotta be kidding me. All right. A friend was absolutely right. A friend just had to go nuts when he's around. Oh, yes. We're going to be fine. Even when the power gets back up and running, we'll be fine. And we're going to be nuts. This is going to be exciting. Wow. 
That's pretty cool, huh? You gotta be kidding. Well, how's that? Well, a friend would have to work hard. Then, I don't think about other friends preparing for storms. So when a storm comes our way, we'll, we'll be safe throughout it. It's trying to take a turn. Yes. As a matter of fact, things will be alright. And I know that um, we're going to be great. We're monitoring what's going on. That for sure is pleasant. So, what's going on with these people? Maybe they're working on it. Close call. I'm the guy who wants to try it out and look good all his life. Alright? Okay, there are banks of light on the other end. Other ends have banks of light. These ends don't. We've got um, candles, flashlights, and other things until good things will happen. Alright, then. I'm going to monitor this situation for you. We can all be fine. Anyway, um, sometimes. What they're going to do is do whatever they can. There's the survivor. Well, you gotta be kidding me. A friend has heard chirping smoke detectors lately. Oh, yes. We gotta monitor what's going on. Yeah. Yeah, right. They're trying to deal with situations in any particular matter. But when friends may hear a little bit of a noise cracking, it might be smoke detectors, it might be other equipment, you know. When things will be alright, they will. We're giving it a go. Yeah. Uh-uh. If we go along, we could have fun. Yeah. Oh, no. Uh-oh. I'm not struck. Danger. Danger. Oh, man. Danger. There are trucks out there and everything. Just want to sit and, and do whatever we can. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Um, it's still dark out there. You know what you're going to do? You're going to be alright with that. Oh. I guess they're coming along the path. But it's too dark out there. We would see street lights. And I know about those chirping smoke detectors. Chirp? That's a good sound for a smoke detector. 
Uh, anyway. Uh, I agree with that. Maybe there's chirping sounds in the smoke detector. What? It's making chirping sounds? Oh, great! Oh, shoot. We have to be fine, will we? We're monitoring the situation as fast as we can. A lot of us are involved in it. Let's sit down when we can. Yeah. All we gotta do is do whatever we can. And stay together. Yep. By the way, they look like they're gonna do it. For sure. All right. We're looking forward to the moment. What should be a big moment. I could be fine. I could be whatever. We know. That is worse than anything. A friend has ever heard something bad. Go down and get with it. Are you all right? Now what's that? Are you right there? You know what? If any smoke detectors chirp, then I think we'll try and replace the battery or have maintenance do it. Or somebody. Oh, well. That's gotta work. But you gotta admit that to me. Frankie thinks that he has a plan for his cancellation. Oh, yeah. Hopefully around town. All right, we're looking good, smiling, laughing, playing it safe as the storm grows larger sometimes. Oh, look, look over there. Oh, yes. Oh, that is good news. I feel like a duck. Do you? No. Uh, chirping at night from smoke detectors is rare. Gaia, that is so cool. I wish Eddie Harrison and Kelly are the survivors. As a matter of fact, they could lose their contracts with HSN because of the hurricane. And as far as I'm concerned, survivors are go, go, go. Try to turn on the juice if you will. All right, they will. Gotcha, Miss O'Brien. All I could hear was the sound of the chirping thing. Ow! Oh, what a noise! I think I'm allowed to differ when someone differs. Get down, okay? I, I know something very easily. It's after Irma. We gotta go in. When it gets here. Oh! What do you think? I have no chances at last. A friend damages a barbecue grill that costs 18 bucks. No way. Anyway, I gotta be feeling good. That's a streetcar, not the electric company trucks. Oh. Oh, those trucks look good. 
Oh. Those trucks are starting to move. Okay. They're trying really hard to exactly see more lights coming and more lights, more lights, and so on. Now as we see more lights. Oh yes. I gotta be kidding. More lights. Alright.